so much. The construction project for building a village for adults with intellectual and developmental disabilities has been delayed. News Channel 10 Sydney Batsloff has been following the progress of Hope Village and joins us now with why and how long construction has been pushed back. Construction was set to begin in April for Advo's Hope Village. However, it's been delayed until September. Advo made some changes to the, its original plans, causing this delay. A change in groundwork has caused for a delay in Hope Village. In addition to the planned shops, the new floor plan shows Hope Village will also have an early learning center. We realized so many individuals need an IDD type learning center. So this was one great way to get this going. It's going to be open for our employees to take their children to, and then it'll be open to the public to fill in the spots that are still needed. Other parts of Hope Village include a warehouse, a custom framing shop, an embroidery and screen printing shop, along with coffee, tea, deli and ice cream shops. Those with special needs will be the employees. Our individuals want to be just like individuals in this community, so providing them the job skills they need that they can transfer to a palace or a roasters or a Jason's Deli. This is going to get them the skills they need to do that. Once the shops and daycare open up, other phases of Hope Village include an accessible park and a gymnasium. It's going to be bring in more Special Olympic events and more practice facilities for individuals. As for funding, the shops and early learning center is about halfway funded and there is still a need for the remaining phases. With the new timeline, construction is set to begin next month with the shops up and running by fall of 2024.